Uh, tonight, a Valley School District is taking a stance against bullying. Researchers say bullying victims are more likely to consider suicide. Channel 5's Cecilia Gutierrez has more on a new app that can help change those statistics. Fear of retaliation is a main reason bullying remains unreported even today. A new app coming to Edinburgh Consolidated ISD helps students reporting the bullying in a quick way, and the reporters remain completely anonymous. Esmeralda Salinas has two children in high school. Her children haven't experienced bullying, but they've seen it happening at school. They have mentioned in the past, but uh, they don't tell me they see a lot of it. Um, I'm not sure if, if uh, they just don't say anything. She says fear of retaliation and cell phones could be a reason bullying keeps happening in schools. Being that I do have two children, uh, I feel that if they're being bullied um, and they want to report it, I. Um, they might be afraid to. But a new app coming to Edinburgh CISD can change a bullied child's phone from a device of constant torment to a safety tool. In approximately 100 school districts in Texas, the app Anonymous Alerts can be found on students' phones. It's truly 100% anonymous and all messaging is encrypted. Says Gregory Bender, the founder of the Anonymous Alerts app. The app not only allows you to stay anonymous while reporting. And there's a help and resources section that is wonderful and provides multiple links and technology and all sorts of uh, videos for the students and a help section for mental health as well. We wanted to know why Edinburgh CISD adopted the app. We have currently does not allow for us to track the statistics of the reporting or the trends of the bullying types um, in the specific campuses where it's occurring most often. Says Sofia Hinojosa, the coordinator of student and social services for ECISD. She says those statistics and anonymous factor are needed to better combat bullying. The reporting goes directly to the campus administration, not only the principal, but also assistant principals, uh, curriculum assistants, and anybody else who the principal assigns to uh, receive the reports. Once a report is sent in, an investigation is conducted within three days. It's in that investigation that administration decides whether bullying is occurring or not. With this app, it is going to allow us to be able to determine if there's additional need for specific campuses within our school district. Hinojosa says the district just wants students to feel comfortable with reporting and getting the help they may need. Even if a child does not have a smartphone to download the app, anonymous alerts can be reached through the web. A link will be set up on the school district's website for those students to access the application set to launch next week. In the newsroom, Cecilia Gutierrez, Channel 5 News at 6.